Today, we shall see an interesting case in a 25-year male who presented with complaints of left neck swelling for the past 3 months. The referring clinician suspected tuberculous lymphadenitis and sent for ultrasonogram of neck. On ultrasonogram, there was this significantly enlarged left supraclavicular lymph node. The lymph node measured about 6 cross 5 cm approximately and showed good internal vascularity. Few other smaller lymph nodes were also noted in left level 3 region. Because of the absence of central necrosis, these enlarged nodes raised suspicion for malignancy somewhere rather than tuberculosis. On right side of the neck, there was no enlarged lymph nodes and bilateral axillary region also showed no enlarged lymph nodes. Then ultrasound screening of abdomen was done which showed multiple enlarged periportal and retropetroleal lymph nodes. Here we can see retropetroneal lymph nodes adjacent to IVC and IOTA. Further evaluation of the abdomen did not reveal any lesion suspicious of malignancy. Then I asked the patient for any lesion in testis and the patient is not aware of any such lesion. Then ultrasound screening of scrotum was done which revealed an irregular hypoechoic lesion in left testis. Good internal vascularity was noted in the lesion. So the final diagnosis is left testicular malignancy with retroperitoneal and supraclavicular infrodal metastasis. Whenever a male patient presents with unexplained lymphadenopathy, testis should always be looked for to rule out malignancy. Thank you.